Hey players, so I have a little bit more information and an update on Justin Timberlake being arrested for driving under the influence last night. Y'all go ahead and grab your tea and have a seat. Let's get into it. It was previously reported last night Justin Timberlake was arrested for driving under the influence in the Hamptons. And initially the uh, police spokesperson would not give any details surrounding the arrest, but uh, Justin has been to court and he says he only had one martini. So the Sag Harbor Police Department confirmed that Justin Timberlake was arrested at 12.37 a.m. for failing to stop his 2025 BMW southbound at a stop sign and failing to maintain his lane of travel. He was arrested for refusing three times to take a chemical test, even though police say he appeared to be drunk and had bloodshot, glassy eyes. The complaint also states that he was unsteady and couldn't focus on speaking with the officers while looking for his car registration. Uh, Justin Timberlake allegedly told officers of the goddamn law that he had one martini and he was following his friends home. So he was taken to the Sag Village Police Department for processing where he refused a request to test for blood alcohol content and was held overnight at another police headquarters. At 9.30 a.m., he was arraigned for driving while intoxicated and released on his own recognizance. Now, it's important to note that the Daily Beast and other news outlets are reporting this as Justin Timberlake being forced to spend nine hours in a Hamptons jail after he was arrested. He wasn't forced to do anything. He refused to take a test, and when you refuse, you are arrested. Now, the New York Post was able to capture this photo of Justin Timberlake as he was leaving the jail to go to the court. Um, the mugshot will not be released unless he's found guilty, according to a police spokesperson. So Justin is expected back in court on July 26. We haven't heard anything from his spokesperson at the time of the making of this uh, video. Again, uh, according to the officers of the goddamn law, he said he only had one martini, but they reported that he had bloodshot eyes, that he was uh, unable to focus, and he was unsteady, uh, and he refused to take a, a blood alcohol test as well as the um, the test that they do on the on the road or whatnot. So it is what it is, honey. He was arrested uh, for refusing to take those tests, and now if he's found guilty, we'll get to see the mugshot. I'm wondering if we can request the uh if there's any body camera footage that we can request if there is any i'm pretty sure that tmz is already working on obtaining that all right players put your thoughts in the comments again i'm making myself clear uh anybody that is uh driving under the influence if it's proven that he was doing that i have no sympathy or empathy for them in that regard especially a person that has means to hire a driver call a personal assistant or use an uber or you was there with your friends, you could have got them to give you a ride, or were they under the influence as well. Justin has been in the headlines uh, lately for other things. So this is going to be very interesting to see how this plays out. Y'all put your thoughts in the comments. This is Double D Mode for the Black Accurate News.